Hello and welcome everyone. I'm Nick. Let's continue our journeys. Episode 10, The Perfect Storm. So this is the perfect storm. I don't understand. Is this a joke or what? Do you think this is a joke, Adam? Not at all. Kitty is in love with me and I'm in love with her. That's a fact. Accept that, Adam. But because she's a great woman and very loyal, she would never do anything to hurt her family. I beg you, set her free. Let her decide how to proceed. Be sympathetic. Take it with humor. I can't believe this guy would say such nonsense. He's confused. I need to keep my cool. Jeno, I know that Katie is a beautiful, amazing woman talented, a good mother, a good friend, a good teacher, maybe for you. You're very confused. No, this is love. I really don't know what to tell you. Then don't tell him anything. Anyway, try talking to her. I feel sorry for you. You are in a clear state of denial. I try to do the right thing. I'm sorry if you won't listen to me. Just listen to him, Adam. Everything will make sense. Hey babe, call me when you hear this message. Today, we will run a simulation of what a night at Mary's would be like. Macy is coming and we're going to work like we do in New York. Wow, I'm speechless. I love it. We'll be with the Macy Katie duo. What time do we start? First, I need to go to the town market. We will prepare Mary's signature dish, country style five step menu. We should go with you. And better yet, go to Mary's and do it there. Yes, I want to see the kitchen at Mary's. I could just die. And we participate in each step of the process. Sure, starting with the selection of the raw materials. Their idea is not half bad. Should we do that? In Mary's? Of course, let's go to Mary's. Free chefs. Alright, we'll go to the market and then to Mary's. I fell in love with the green pot market at first sight. This town inspired the five-step country style dish. And at Mary's, we'll make the magic happen. A perfect day. I'll let Macy know we're on our way. Yeah, free worker for Mary's. This is the heart of Greenport, the market. Thanks to this market, I completely revamped the menu at Mary's. And you took the number spot in the Chef Magazine ranking. Number, number one, I mean. Jano is your number one fan. I believe he is. Any tips? Let yourself be carried away by your gut, by your sense of smell. Literally, you have to keep an open mind to renew and innovate. Shall we? What do you get? I found this mustard, it's from Dijon, but its aroma is different. What does it inspire you to do? A rabbit stew? Rabbit stew? This place is magical. I found a very aromatic variety of watercress. Do we all have our findings? Yes, flowers. I'm imagining a salad with flowers. Perfect. Now we are ready to go to New York. Business as usual. A dream come true, working in the kitchen at Mary's. Are you ready? Yes, where do we start? The kitchen, of course. I'll assign the roles. Let them decide. I'll tell you your roles, Charlotte. You lead us. Yes. Adrian, 
will be the shoe chefs and Jaro will do the plating the perfect team Wait, what happened? alright you're familiar with the ingredients it was a great idea to go to the market yeah then let's get to work they are growing as chefs it's exciting to watch them She's busy, Adam, with Chano. It's strange that Katie is not calling me back. I have to tell her about Chano, or I won't be able to concentrate on anything else. Well, she's not here. She's with Chano in New York, abandoning you. Katie? That's odd. Where is everybody? I understand less and less. And she still won't pick up. The marjoram production smells sublime. God, your perfume is perfect. I'm not wearing perfume. Lilies, lilies and a touch of vanilla. That's my soap. You can smell that like a cake. Yes, I love it. Hold on. Let me try something. Close your eyes. Do you smell anything? Big peppercorns. I'm far away from you and you figured it out. What is that? In the middle of this chaos of aromas? Is that a bad thing? No, it's amazing. It's your talent. Your nose. I was wondering how you came up with your flavor combinations. Your way of seasoning, it's not your palate, it's your sense of smell. I have no nose like everyone else. Your sense of smell is very sharp. It's your secret weapon. Because of it, you are going to succeed. You think? I'm absolutely certain and I'm going to help you. To succeed? Relax, hon. Everything is going perfect. Your students are doing great. Yeah, that's not it. I feel like there's something I'm forgetting. Adam, that's what I was forgetting. I have to call him. You forget your husband. Nice. I never thought the five-step country style menu could be so delicate. I appreciate every minute I spent with you, Katie. I'm glad. Thanks. So many compliments. Kitty deserves that and a whole lot more. And tell me, Jado, don't you have something to do in the kitchen, perhaps? Oh yeah, I'll get back to my classmates. Yeah, get to work. Your student fell in love with you. No, Macy, he admires me. He idolized me. But that's all. I wouldn't be so sure. Be careful. Why should be careful? She would enjoy that. Do we have any moss melon pickles? Yes, hon. They are in the fridge. I forgot to tell them that they have to use them at room temperature. Yes, you forgot Adam again. She's not gonna call Adam. You're here early. You don't read the news, do you? There will be a storm in a while. I was busy thinking about a thousand things. Are you okay? You seem a little off. He's always off. It's just that Katie is very busy with the residency and... Let's leave it at that. Come on, you can tell me anything. What happened between you two? Katie is busy with a new toy. Open up to him. One of Katie's students fell in love with her. And he thinks she feels the same for him. He came to ask me to let her go. And what did Katie say? We were not able to talk yet. Is this Jano with her now? Yes. Listen, you are a solid couple. You are in love. These are things that happen with students. Don't take it seriously. Of course not. Then you should leave her. Wait, are you jealous? I don't know about jealous, but I don't like the situation at all. So you're not even jealous, Adam? 
Why don't you text me, Teddy? Relationship problem, you too? Baby, why are you crying? Because Teddy made me believe that he felt the same way I feel about him. But he dumped me and he didn't even show his face. He texted me. I'm so disappointed. Maybe you're right and he's just as bad as his father. It's the first time she's had her heart broken. I should help her. Keep her company. Go away, Dad. I don't want you to see me crying. Why? Forget it. I'm not leaving you alone. Let's go to the movies. Let's watch a romantic film. The kind that makes you cry even more. I find that helps a lot. Your daddy needs that too. You mean cry more to cry less? What? It works for me. Why don't we try it? Okay, we've got nothing to lose. There's a faster way, Adam. Like chili to your face. I cried my eyes out. I didn't know I had so much water in my eyes. It is very sad how the couple breaks up. And all because of misunderstandings, I wanted to shut open your eyes. But afterwards, when they kissed, I almost died. I cried at that point too. It was so moving. You're very sensitive, Dad. I like that. You can understand me. You can share anything with me. What I understand and what I don't. I will always be there for you. Life hurts sometimes. But when everything goes wrong, the best thing to do is to be with the people who love us. Things may not get fixed, but we'll share the burden. It worked for me. It did me good. Thank you, Dad. Ice cream? You're not a kid anymore, but some things don't change. Chocolate ice cream with sprinkles. The usual one. Oh, we got back just in time. It's starting to rain. I like storms. Especially if you're home. You're feeling better, aren't you? Much better and thanks to you. Babe, where are you? Busy. Oh, babe, I'm beat. But we did great. We just got back from New York. I'm in the dome, making sure everything's okay with the storm. Be there in a few. Or not. Wow, it's really coming down. The dome. Is she avoiding me? Duh, it's obvious, Adam. And she won't stop even in this storm. What does she have to do in the dome? Not alone. Jano, what are you doing here? You said you were coming to the dome and I worried about the storm. Well then, help me make sure everything is shut tight. If the wind gets in here, we could lose the whole lot of crops. Where do we start? Go to the hydroponic section and... Why are you looking at me like that, Jano? It's obvious! I can hide it! I'm in love with you! Jano, I'm in love with you too! Wait, let me talk. I know it's hard, but it's not a bad thing. It's just love. And a kiss, yes, in front of Adam. That's your proof, Adam. She doesn't even try to reject that. Thank you for watching. Have a wonderful day. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. And see you guys on our next journeys.